What is up, YouTube? And happy Halloween to anybody watching this. As of right now, it is that hallowed holiday where people go around dressed like other people so they can scam people out of candy and money and stuff like that. Um, so in honor of a day like this, I'm going to watch a video that relates to exactly what people do on a holiday like this. They pretend like they're something else in order to scam people out of their goods. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna watch a video. Um, I'm a big fan of combat sports, uh, martial arts, boxing, um, just about anything like that. And something that's always brought me joy. So I'm gonna be watching it just to make myself happy and hopefully you guys will laugh too. Um, this is a video on martial art frauds, the type of people that be doing the whole knocking people out without touching them and you know the fake ninjas and all the type of people showing off martial art techniques you will find on the back of comic books and things like that um, and you know the dollar store martial arts manuals so the video I'm watching today is called martial arts frauds and fakes and cults this was this video was made by uh, Sentra Studios so be sure to check them out and subscribe to them if you like this video um, I'm going to jump right into it because I'm really interested in seeing this. I was actually going to watch it without reacting to it, but after like the first five seconds of the video, I said I got to make a reaction to this. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into it and we can watch it together. So let's go ahead and see what this thing has to offer. Breathe in, pull the energy in, pull it down, and push Hopefully, this video doesn't fingers. stop itself because this more video is over power, 20 power. minutes. More passion, more power. Big. Look into the hands. Good. Good. Yes, like that's good. You see why I had to react to it now. You want to defend? As soon as you see me move, everything you got in there, you push it out. What can we do it? We can do it. Hold on. Let's go. Sure. It's like the people that be passing out in church. Yes, come here. <coughs> you stand here, and Magnus and Rebecca, you pre prepare her. Pause, hold up. Just so you know, this woman isn't, like, part of their group. She just came to, like... Try it out. We'll, we'll, we'll see how you know, things work out for her. I think I, yeah, see, I've seen this video. I've seen this this clip right here. <laughs> I love how he was still acting. <laughs> From here, boom, I'm gonna step in, elbow the ribs. Right here, I just hug right here. Real simple, guys. Step forward. Simple, right? Munkai can go connection. He don't shoot to key for wrong seek defense. Each to come you. Ni Nagashuki. San get down shoot. Each to come you. Ni Nagashuki. San get down shoot. Is the person just gonna let go of it? This chick needs to play football. Simply, I said she got a stiff arm man. like that. She could take people out worse than Marshawn Lynch. Okay. Yeah. First, it is only bearable for two to three seconds, but eventually the body can be supported for minutes at a time. By which time you'll have mastered the technique. That made me sad. It I thought stuff like that was real. Throughout the body, without it, you don't function, and it, it's a radio wave. Science can't find G. It doesn't. It doesn't exist as far as science can tell. Without a doubt, George Dillman is a force to be reckoned with. He's a ninth-degree black belt who has taught everyone from Muhammad Ali to Bruce Lee. Just because you take a picture with somebody, don't mean you taught them. <coughs> It didn't work. Dillman thinks he knows what went wrong and has come up with a very interesting explanation. The skeptic was un was a, a totally non-believer. 
an unbeliever. Plus, I don't know if I should say that on film, but if the guy had his tongue in the wrong position of the mouth, uh, that can also what? nullify it. Yeah, you can nullify it. You can nullify a lot of things done to you. In fact, you can nullify it if you raise those two big toes. Plus, See, I know what this guy's doing, and it's genius. You know what he's doing? He's telling people that, see, he's giving you half of what you need to do early, and he's giving you the other half now. So what he has to do is, in order for this to work, he has to get you to put your tongue in the right spot. So he'll have a conversation with you, and he'll know exactly what letter your tongue is going to be in in certain parts. So he'll be like, okay, I'm waiting for that L sound. So, um, yeah, uh, where, where'd you go yesterday? The library. <laughs> and, and just fuck you up. So... I guess that's what he's doing. He's trying to get people. He's trying to tell you, okay, well, in order for this to work, you got to get them in the, the, the tongue in the right spot. And he's about to say something else. So. If I say I'm going to knock you out, and you raise one toe and push one toe down, can't knock you out. And then if I go to try again, you reverse it. If you keep doing this, I won't knock you out. Plus, the skeptic was un was a, a totally non-believer, non-believer. Plus. And I moved a, the line. It's a lot of Plus, goddamn pluses. I've flatlined several people. Plus, I know I have chi energy. You can see it with the half moons. My chi is up went now to because library, I'm that met this I have guy. half moons in my fingertips now. Plus, got sent to the hospital. I can put the largest person that you can find in the world, and I've done this with that finger. I can put him on the floor. He met the largest person in the world and put him in the hospital. See, what y'all ain't realizing is right now what y'all watching, this dude has like a second soul in him like Shadow of Mordor, and, and he does a move, and then the other ghost just comes out and starts whooping everybody else's ass. That, that's, that's what happens. See, we're just the orcs. Yeah, we're just the orcs. He, he, he does something, and then a, the second ghost comes out and just... And everybody just goes out. Come on, this can't be fake. I thought that was real. Capability and is flexibility in a way, you know. So, hold on. These are some new recruits for the airline. Before they become flight attendants, they must complete six hours of Wing Chun training. For many of them, it's the first time they've done any form of martial arts. They start with a hundred punch warm up. See, this would be good if they could. Um Learn some like close quarters combat. You endurance. can't really do too much posturing and things like that inside of a damn Over three classes, airplane. these flight attendants will learn the first form in the Wing Chun system, called Sunim Tao, and some self-defense techniques. <laughs> this dude with the this dude with the receding hairline is cracking me up. <laughs> he just, <laughs> See, everybody know he a bad motherfucker. He just jumped at people and they feel like, oh. It's only important to visualize it. Try to visualize it. Then touch those two fingers to those neck dimples just beneath your skull. Put some pressure there, one deep breath and that golden ball of light that's bright and hot during the breath. I'm on the garage, his dude was just sitting at home one day scratching the back of his neck. He touched the right spot, I was like, then I can make money off telling people about this shit. the third eye between the brow. Same thing, golden ball of light in the brain, skull and head. Right and hot, deep breath. Again, that's bullshit. Yeah, Everybody that watches Dragon Ball Z know the third eye is right here. And fight these guys and show the power of Chinese Kung Fu. Damn, I look like Tian. I need to chill. And they're talking as if that is the beacon and highest level of martial arts is to win a title in the UFC. And that is just so false. So that was approximately six breaths. And this is the beginning of what we call the small circle of heaven meditation. Okay.
I never really got why people would um do all of this and like the katas and shit when it okay damn I never knew why people do the katas and things like that like practicing martial arts because I don't think you do that in a real fight so the thing is to punch at me and I was to do uh, Uchi Uke you can see that I go one two right at least one two Worse than chasing a black belt in a martial arts style that just don't make no damn sense. What's going to happen is after I've struck this, this side is going to stretch, making the nerves on this part of the neck very, very vulnerable to a strike. Now I can actually strike with approximately half the force that I'd be able to strike in this chin in this, in this position. So what I've done is I've tricked the body into thinking the blood pressure just shot up really rapidly, and that'll cause the body to go horizontal because the blood pressure will drop and it needs to equalize. So what's going to happen is he's actually going to faint from a reasonably light strike to his neck. Lock this way and get a sharp twist here. Can I okay? So I've hit here and now he strikes. Now I've activated the small intestine radian. I'm going to come and strike small intestine on the opposite side. What if he needs you in the nuts? Oh, I can't do that. Come on now, you don't want to make kids even more hard-headed. And what is going on over here? See, I think when that guy walked past, they switched the spears at that exact moment. It's like, no, I don't know what the hell's going on right now. Could be the fact that this dude is, like, driving the van. That's a lot of movement to try to get that damn knife out of that dude's hand. <laughs> Don't it look like he's thinking about what the hell to do next in the middle of the damn movement? He's like, oh, oh, okay. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Like, it looked like he's just going along with it, and just thinking while it's happening. Yeah, like, I'm Say, what if what if the cows care more about like helping it like not ripping the dude in half than they do about getting their butts broken? See the cow thing. Comes y'all on, play. you drop, the cow you know turn, you're trying to take him down. Strike, let you do it. Strike, 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 strike. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. 
right? Give her a clap, give her a clap, would ya? Very easy. Imagine that she's going to punch me. I redirect and at the same time I punch that spot. Okay? That's very important that you know that not only can be pressed, but it can be hit. Or even what I was saying, it can be wrapped. You wrap the point, okay? And it causes more pain. Okay? Very important. Careful when you're practicing with your partner, okay? So the second Let point that we're going to see today is going to be located uh, on the knees. things like this to think this stuff works in a real fight. When you get in a real fight, there's this thing called adrenaline. You try to hit someone in their funny bone and all other bullshit, it's not going to work. If a motherfucker wants to kill you, the little funny feeling in his arm ain't going to stop him. Now his thumb is very vulnerable. If he doesn't move his hand, it will break. So I take his thumb, get it rid of it, bring this here, and then use that as a thumb. It's the oldest structure in the Shaolin Temple. And inside, there are 48 small depressions in the floor. Legend has it that they are formed by hundreds of years of Kung Fu training. As the monks channel their chi through their feet, striking the ground with incredible force. Or it could be the fact that that building is like a thousand some years old and, you know, constantly stepping on it would do that over time. Oh my God. <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> That uppercut was unnecessary. That was that was wrong, man. Look at him. He, he still don't know what the hell's going on. That's fucked up. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Bro, stop it. Just stop. Just stop. <laughs> that was so wrong. I can't get over that fucking, that sneak uppercut. That was just wrong. Turns out that my first challenge is to hold the buckets of water in a horse stance for at least three minutes. And it's easier said than done. Yes, sir. Justin, you compete with Xiao Song now. Xiao Song will perform the Chao Tian Dung stance on one foot, while you perform horse stance on both feet. Whoever loses will do 100 push-ups as punishment. Begin. Did anybody have those teachers back in the day that would make you like hold books or something like that while you had your arms out? And you just had to sit there in the hallway like this? Physically, this is where the term boot camp I'm not, really applies. I'm not sure where martial arts training and sustain, school discipline uh, like your muscles merges, but it's somewhere around in that area. You broke my you broke my good china bowls. Now you must die. You have lost. Do 100 push-ups. Okay. This seems like a one-sided fight, but I have no idea which side is the like the bottom. If the person the is able to remain in this state for more than three weeks, which rarely happens, his body gradually shrinks, and in the end, all that remains from the person is his hair, nails, and clothes. Usually, in this case, people who live next to the monks see a rainbow that glows in the sky for several days. This means that he has found a rainbow body. This is the highest state close to the state of Buddha. Без контактного православного боя, причем не просто бесконтактного православного боя, бесконтактного православного боя с использованием православного креста. It doesn't look like. It doesn't look like. This dude it doesn't look like. Vampires just strengthened his toes and ran at a high speed. However, and that bridge don't have was unsuccessful, ending about two thirds of the way down the runway. And that bridge has no. Like, After resting for has nothing to do with the whole stepping on water thing. Okay, oh, that was a movie. Besides, Mr. M Mr. Miyagi is badass. 
Hitting a candle flame from a distance is an exercise that promotes the explosive power of a punch. Oh, really try to, try to He really tried. He 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 tried. <laughs> 身上，任何地方都和一个钢板一样。我们看到辛伊犁的身高比较高，身高一米七九，要比翼龙要高。See, UFC needs Chinese voiceover. It'll make the fight so much more interesting. 今天这个辛伊犁打得过于保守。I'm sorry, Joe Rogan, but if you learn how to speak uh, Mandarin, it'll make the show a lot more, you know, authentic feeling. After fighting, pa 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 pa, no matter how you fight, pa pa, pum, and he. Even boom, those kind of position is a very important. Jackie Chan is teaching you how to fight with a bench. Who the hell can do that? Kick him in the knee. Phoenix. What it does is rise up. The heat will rise. It opens up the inner of your skull. So by like rising phoenix, it's like opening up the yin energy or the more softer, calmer. I, I think yeah, the yin energy could to calm the yang. So it's not gonna be like a no, it's not. I'm not gonna it, be. Does this do remind anybody else of like a blonde Tom Cruise? But it have antioxidant. It have um, all the okay. enzyme to neutralize yeah. the caffeine. So it give you a very balance. It give mm. you high energy without the jitter. Right. Right. Okay. Yeah. 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 Keep drinking. I'm not gonna lie. I thought that was like a martial arts gay couple in like West Hollywood or something. I mean, nothing against it, but that's what it looked like to me. Like, you see those specials where they be talking about like renovating their house or something like that, and they be sitting there talking to each other, and that's what I, that's what it looked like to me. Except, except instead of renovating houses, they were talking about martial art techniques. Someone need to check these monks for CTE. Wang Gong, Little man know what he's doing. I don't know how effective it is or whatever, but I know that he got it down to a goddamn T, that's for sure. That's how I applaud that all day. It's all fun and games until somebody falls on somebody else. Everybody got to start somewhere, goddammit. You ain't just start off sleeping on ropes and can master that shit. At some point, somebody fell on some goddamn body. was entertaining um man i hope this camera's still recording because if it isn't i'm gonna be pissed but um you guys will well actually you won't see that because i probably won't upload it if it did screw up but anyway anybody out there who's had martial arts training uh who might be able to watch some something like this and notice any wrong techniques or if there's anything that you've seen in martial arts like on youtube or anything you know, if somebody else that's screwing up badly and just doing just straight up bad technique, bad form, bad martial arts, period. 
be sure to leave a comment down in the comment section. I want to see what you guys have to offer. I like to react to more things like this. I've seen a few of them. And, you know, just keep me posted. So uh, I'll probably end up doing something else Halloween related because, you know, to celebrate the holidays and everything. Um, if you guys have anything else you want me to react to besides martial arts, you can also leave those in the comment section. I will be reading them. Um, I'll have my Let's Draw or Da Vinci Draws video up soon. Um, I do have some questions for it. Not a lot, but I will answer all the questions that I can. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to go ahead and move on to the next video. This has been the original Renaissance man, Devon Da Vinci. I'm not sure if I said that at the beginning of the video, but I am now. Um, I'm signing out. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.